Hey, what is up you guys? You Pixeled here and welcome back to Spider-Man Remastered. Now, I gotta be honest, I've been sitting here just listening to the main menu music for the past maybe 20 minutes and oh, the music in this game is so freaking good. I'm just sitting here enjoying the music. Oh, look at that. Ooh. It's so good. It's so good. Anyways, let's jump into this before I just sit here for hours listening to this. Let's jump into this. Okay, so in last week's video, I did tell you guys that on my own time, I wanted to go around and do all of the surveillance towers, and that's what I did. I did every single one except this one, because this one is really, really close to the next main mission, and I know that sometimes when you get close to main missions, characters get a phone call, or they start talking, and all of that, and I didn't want to accidentally... Um, have important dialogue happen without you guys being here like I didn't want you guys to miss anything so I just avoided this area completely and I did not get close to this main mission at all oh Jesus that scared the fuck out of me did you guys hear that sorry I was drinking a, a, a Baja Blast earlier and I guess the bottle just popped um anyways yeah, I didn't want to get close to this uh, next main mission just in case dialogue played. But as I was swinging through New York City trying to do all of the surveillance towers, I did get a phone call. I think it was from MJ. And I'm going to play it for you guys now because luckily the PlayStation 5 records everything. Um, so I'm going to play it for you guys now because I think it's probably important dialogue. Hey, we're running another piece on Jefferson Davis and it made me wonder... How's his son Miles doing? Not good. I've been there. The loss is all you can think about. He needs something to do outside of school. Maybe a part-time job? That's not a bad idea. But it has to be the right job. Something that makes him feel useful, like what he's doing matters. Kind of think you just described Feast. MJ, that's perfect. I'll talk to May about it. That's what I'm here for. So yeah, I got that phone call while I was swinging through New York City trying to do all of the surveillance towers and I thought that what they said was important enough to save that video clip and play it here for you guys because I think it it's important to the story what they said in that phone call. So um, yeah, I just decided to add it on here. Um, but anyways, why don't we just jump straight in to the main mission, right? Yeah, we should do that. Oh, do we have any skill points? I don't think we do. No, we don't. We literally got zero skill points. Okay, well, <laughs> I guess we'll just go to the main mission. Dual purpose. Ooh, okay. Sit at port side. Please copy. MJ's hunch was right. The place is crawling with demons. Gotta take these guys out, then have a look around. Sounds like an absolute plan. Uh, danger. Danger? Um, oh. Safe. Okay. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Okay, nobody noticed that. Nobody noticed that. Great. Is he safe now? Danger. Um. Shit, there's like guys everywhere. Okay, uh, what if we get some people's attention that way? Right? Uh, shit, is there really not another light that I could, like, hang off of? Danger still? Really? Danger. Danger. Everybody... Ugh, okay, there's too many guys here, and I just want to take people down quietly. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, okay. That sort of worked. That sort of worked. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So far, so good. So far, so good. Um, I'm a little bit, you know, nervous, but that's just because that's the type of person I am. Every time I play a game where you could play it stealthily, I always try to go for the stealth. But I'm not that great with stealth, so I feel like I'm just gonna fuck up or something. Uh, safe. Okay. Great. So far, so good. So far, so good. He's also safe. But there's a big dude here that I kind of want to get rid of. But the thing is, can I even quietly take him down? I can't remember. I can't remember if the big dudes are almost like impossible to get rid of or something. Um, safe. Okay. So far, so good. Great. And I know you're alone, right? Yeah. 
And then this guy over here is alone. So I'm pretty sure we could get rid of him easily. Where are you going? Come on, dude. Come on. Okay. So far, so good. <laughs> so far, so good. Okay, that's all of them. Huh. High security lock. They use these on banks, not recycling centers. Maybe if I can find where it gets its power from. Is it behind this thing? No, it's this way. Oh, this thing. Am I? What am I supposed to do with this? You want me? Am I supposed to? Looks like I could override the circuit. Need my electric webs. Okay. Um. Let's get the. Oh, we already had them. Well, that did something. It looks like the circuits need a little more juice. Where's the other thing? Uh. Oh, this thing. There. Looks like the circuit's still stable. Maybe there's another junction box close by. Oh my god, how many boxes are there? Jesus. Really? Gotcha. Let me guess, Almost we need one there. more? One more box should do it. That's it. I don't know who the hell wired up this place, but they did a terrible job. from Fisk's armory. Truck bombs? This is crazy. Lots of high-tech equipment. Maybe later I can recycle this stuff into some weapons of my own. These must be where they're planning to attack. Wait, these are Osborne campaign offices. Explosives from Fisk's construction site. This wasn't a gang war. The demons were stealing from Fisk to go after Mayor Osborne. Hey, did you find Lee? No, but you were right. Lee's using this place as a front for the demons. Bomb making, gun running. Oh my god. And it looks like they're planning another attack. This time on Norman Osborne's campaign offices. We must have some kind of beef with Norman Osborne. I found an address here. I think it's their staging area. If I hurry, I might be able to stop them. Be careful. Yuri, it's me. Make it quick. I'm busy getting yelled at by my boss. Martin Lee and the demons are planning another attack, this time on Norman Osborne's campaign offices. Are you sure? We've had a lot of false leads in the past week. Trust me on this one. I'm sending you the address of a recycling center. You'll find all the evidence there. Got it. I'll get those campaign offices evacuated. But if you're wrong about this, you're gonna help me find a new job. Consolidated shipping. A lot of guys. I should try to do this quietly. But also with style. So let's try to take out the snipers that we saw first, right? Uh, wait, what are we doing? Oh, trip mine. I completely forgot about the fucking trip mine. I can use that stuff I found at the recycling center. Awesome. Yeah, I completely forgot about the trip mine. I don't remember nice. using it. Love using bad guys' own weapons against them. And that, my friends, is what karmic justice looks like. Yeah, but I feel like that's risky to use because people might, like realize what's going on maybe i don't or maybe not i mean i guess that did get that dude's attention and it kind of worked but i i don't i don't know uh let's go up here um hmm. shit it says that he's not safe why isn't he safe 
who sees him? Oh, okay, this dude over here is looking out for him, I guess. What if we put... Oh, that is not what I meant to click. But you know what? Okay. <laughs> it was a mistake, but you know what? It was a beautiful mistake. That was a beautiful mistake. That's okay. That is okay. So now there's a guy over there. Can we go over here without being seen? Okay. So far, so good. Let's grab his ass. And then I think we should try to take care of the snipers first. Um, can we go over here? Okay. You're safe. Sleep it off. Okay. And then let's go up here. And then... I don't know. Here? And then back here. Okay. Is he safe? He is. Okay, I think that's all of the snipers. I think it was only two. I'm not sure. I think it was only two, right? I don't I don't know. I honestly don't know. Are you safe? You are safe. Oh, danger. Wait. Safe? Okay. <laughs> Let's get rid of him. And then You guys noticed that? How? What did you guys hear? I don't know what you guys heard, but like um you didn't hear a thing. You did not What the fuck? Oh, shit. Let's go back up here. Let's go up here. Okay. I did not... Okay. Uh, perch takedown. I mean, thanks for coming up here. Now you're next to your little buddy. That is so cute. Okay. And then let's try to get rid of this dude. But should we get rid of this dude first? Let's get rid of this dude <laughs> first. See that and then um, let's go up here. Okay. And then perch takedown. And then I think there's two guys back here. Um, yeah, they're all alone. That's cute. Are you guys having, like, a secret meeting? Are you guys dating secretly? What's happening? Okay. Lee's not out here. Better check inside. Good thing I stopped this when I did. You could blow up half of Manhattan with this stockpile. Invoice from an auto shop. Pale horse rides. That's one expensive tune-up. What else can I find around here? They have bases all around the city. This is bigger than I thought. Looks like the demons have an army. As if one deadly glowing whip wasn't enough. I don't know what I was expecting, but it was definitely not this. Hey, MJ, I think I stopped the demon's attack on Osborne's campaign offices. Nice. Did you find Lee? No, but I found something we should look into. A place called Pale Horse Rise. Sounds familiar. I'll check it out and get back to you. Whoa! Before we do this, who the 
hell are you guys? Code SM1. Code SM1. Holding for orders. Copy code SM1. I have a visual. Hold for Silverbird. Entrance. Solid eight out of ten. Nine out of ten. Release him. He works with us. Yuri, explanation, please. This is Silver Sablanova, head of Sable International. A private security force. Paid for by Mayor Osborne. Oh, the mayor has a pet army now? Next time you get in my way, I will not be so gentle. Go. We'll talk later. about that Sable thing. I should have told you earlier, but it all happened so fast. It's okay. We're still best buds. We're not best buds. Well, that took a dark turn. Anyway, Sable has the mayor's ear and unchecked authority. We've searched that address you gave me, found plenty of evidence of a bomb plot, but nothing that leads back to Martin Lee. I'm working on that. Hey, MJ. Hey, so I dredged up some records on Martin Lee's other business holdings. He's got places all over the city. Huh. The locations line up with a map I found at that shipping business. I'll check them out. Let me know what you find at each one, and I'll work on building a case. You got it. I'm headed to Lee's office at Feast to see if I can learn more about why he's doing this. And what he's got planned next. Okay. Say hi to May for me. Wait, you don't think she's in danger, do you? No. Lee's only got one target on his mind. Norman Osborne. Peter. So if you're running this place while Mr. Lee's out of town, who's doing your old job? Uh, me. But I could always use more help. You know anyone? Actually, I do. His name is Miles Morales. Why does that sound familiar? His father was being honored at City Hall. Oh. I talked to him at the funeral. He's a smart kid. He's just having a tough time. I knew a boy like that once. I remember it helped to uh, stay busy. It might help him too. Here's his mom's number. Thanks. I'll give her a call. Hey, you haven't heard from Mr. Lee, have you? No, why? I'm just curious. I've got a few minutes before work. I'm gonna look around, see if there's anything else I can do to help you out. Oh, you, you don't have to. I know. I want to. I should check out Lee's office. Okay, um... Can we talk to Aunt May? Does she need anything? Need help with those veggies? I learned a long time ago, you're more help staying out of the kitchen than in it. Okay. Well, I guess I won't offer any more help in the kitchen. I was just trying to be nice, you know? Uh, what is this? You know what's crazy? When I first played this game, I never did that. I didn't even think that was a thing. I, so you're okay. I just in there. I just ran straight into the mission objective, but now I feel like I need to clean. Um, we did one of three. Where are the other spills? I, I don't know. Because this place seems clean. I'm not seeing any more messes. I'm pretty sure her office is going to be very clean. Yeah. Wait, what is this? Have we interacted with this yet? Um, I mean, we interacted with that photo already. Anyways, where are the, where are the other spills? I want to, you know, I want to help a little. I want to clean up a little bit. We already did one, so if we already started, might as well finish. 
Your aunt works too hard. Tell her to take the day off. Okay. Um, but yeah, if we already cleaned one mess, might as well People clean don't the others. How many kids are homeless? One in thirty. And too many shelters aren't equipped to care for them. Okay, well that's that's a depressing statistic to uh, get in the middle of playing a video game. That is kind of sad. What do I have to clean? Is this what I have to clean? Everyone feels hopeless at some point. Helps to know there's somebody willing to listen. Yeah, when I first played this game, I never even went back into this like office. I didn't even know that this was here. You know, I feel like this is a good thing about playing video games for like a second time. You get to experience things a little bit differently. Uh, oh, here's the other mess. Hey, I heard you at City Hall for the bombing. You okay? Just a little banged up. How are you doing? Not bad. Your aunt's been helping me with my interview skills. I don't know. I'm not sure I'm cut out for the nine to five. I know I've had my share of career hurdles, but you never know until you try. Give it a shot. Let's clean up this mess. Okay, so where is the third mess? Is is it back here? Um, hmm. No. Yeah, I don't know where the third mess is. It, we don't. I don't think we've gone down this hallway yet. Is it in the main area where everyone is sleeping? I don't know. Peter, you're okay. I'm so relieved. May was really worried. I know, but I'm fine. Uh, yeah, I don't... Is this it? What is that? That looks like throw up. Um, where is the third mess? I don't think it's in this main area. No, could it be upstairs? Did we check the other hallway upstairs or no? I don't I think so. Where's the third mess? I don't know. Did we go this way? I don't know if we went this way. Uh, did we? I'm starting to think that we didn't. Where's the other mess? I'm trying to clean this place. <laughs> um, yeah, I don't know where the third mess is and also a loud ass cop car is passing by my apartment building. Yeah. I don't know where the third mess is. I feel like I walked all over this place. I haven't encountered another mess. So let's just go to the main mission objective because I'm not seeing any- <gasps> There it is! There it is! Okay, let's go clean. Let's go clean. <laughs> I just, you know, let's tidy up a bit. Let's tidy up a bit, you know, help Aunt May because why not? So let's go over here and clean this up. Okay, awesome. Now we could actually do what we came here to do <laughs> now that we've cleaned up the place. Um, I, I feel like that was low-key a waste of time, but you know what? I wanted to do it. I wanted to do it. Hmm, this office is locked. How do I get in there quietly? Well, it seems like they left at the perfect time, so... Maybe there's a vent somewhere. It's right here. Huh. Never seen that room before. Whoa, what the... High voltage lines. What needs this much power? I understand, but the account number is in Mr. Lee's office, which is inaccessible. I will call you back as soon as I can get that information. No, I don't know when that will be. <sighs> what would Ben do? That room I saw from the crawl space. It should be right on the other side of the shrine. Lee's journal. A key. 
key. Wonder where the lock is. Should we close that curtain so no one sees that we're snooping? I feel like that would be a smart thing to do. Huh. The shrine in the photo is missing the picture. Looks like this note is for May. Hmm. Some kind of puzzle lock. That seems right. Oh, I see. Yes! Whoa. What are you hiding, Lee? He's giving his powers to the others. How does Lee imbue these with his power? Bioelectric induction? Compressed phase shift? I don't know, but this shit looks fucking awesome. Lee sure is obsessed with masks. Is it a Jungian thing? Like, he needed to pretend to be someone else to let his darkest feelings out? Pretended to be a demon. Until he became one. Can feel my power growing, feeding off my anger. Father would say I've lost the path of balance that he could never understand. The only way to fight a monster is to become one. Creepy. Oh, this is the folder MJ found at the auction house. This might help us figure out what Lee's planning next. Phew. It's a burn room, wired to destroy evidence. Uh, am I supposed to electrocute this? One more. One more where? Oh, I see. Okay. I, I didn't see this one back here. The police had found this. Or May. Don't want to think of what could have happened. Get out of here. Hello, Peter. Mr. Lee. I thought you were out of town. Did you find what you were looking for? Martin, you're back. I get that. Thank you. And heading off again shortly, I'm afraid. Just needed a few things from my office. You must have heard about City Hall. Yes. Tragic. Peter was there. He was very lucky. And an Osborne rally. I didn't know you were a fan. Well, what matters is you are both safe. Amen. But the bombers are still out there. Who knows what they've planned next? Oh, I don't think you or May have anything to worry about. As long as you stay away from places you're not supposed to be. Well, I should go. When will you be back? When my work is done.
Wait, wait! Watanabe. I finally got your evidence. Head to the Feast Center in Chinatown. What am I going to find? A nice lady named Mae Parker. And some really weird stuff hidden in Lee's office. But listen, he's got another attack planned. Where? When? Still working on that, but I think he's going to use something called Devil's Breath. Sounds destructive. What is it? A substance created by Oscorp. Probably a bioweapon of some kind. I have a folder full of info on it. I'm holding on to it for now. I'll send copies as soon as I can. Okay, we'll check his office. If the evidence stands up, I'll put out an APB. MJ, hey. Just checking in. Peter, hey. Can I call you back? I think you'll want to hear this. Wait, why are you whispering? Just in the middle of something. How about we catch up over dinner? My place? Oh, sure. I'll even cook. Cool. See ya. Wait. Remember how you told me about Lee's corrupting touch? I think I just saw it in action. How? Some perfectly nice homeless people just jumped me. Thing is, they had glowing eyes. And I remembered Yuri telling me something similar about the guard who released Shocker. So Shocker was working for Lee? Uh, it's all connected. There's more. But I guess we'll talk about it at dinner. Yeah, see ya. Dinner? <sighs> what should I cook? Food? I feel like that's the best thing to cook. Food? Okay. So, where are we headed? Where are we going? I don't know. <laughs> I legitimately don't know. Um, oh, we got new suit mods. Okay. Um, oh, we can't afford some of these because we need to get more landmark tokens and research tokens. And honestly, I just kind of want to focus on the main story because, I mean, I don't really feel like doing a lot of the side content since I, I mean, I've already played this game before and I platinumed it. So I really don't feel like doing any of the side content. I just want to play through the main story to refresh my brain. Um, and then I'm going to play through the main story of Miles Morales to refresh my brain <laughs> and then get ready for Spider-Man 2 to release. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. Um, I, you know what? Yeah, okay. So this one, wait a minute. Y you know what? I like this one. Let's craft that one. Okay. And then I don't think we have anything else we can craft, right? No. Damn, I am going to have to do some of these side stuff, right? Um, yeah, I think I'm going to have to do some of this side stuff on my own time. Landmark tokens, first aid. Yep, I think I'm going to have to do some of this stuff, even though I kind of don't want to. I feel like I'm going to have to, especially if I want to upgrade some of these gadgets. Even though I can't upgrade this one. Spider drone. Um, I don't know. And we have two skill points. What can we get with two skill points? Stealth takedowns generate much more focus. Ooh. And then, which one is this one? Ooh. <laughs> I like that. Okay. So far, so good. So now, where do we have to go? Like, what's where's our next main mission? Also, I still have to go back and do this one, but I'm gonna do that on my own time. This is Stable Control. What's the situation? Oh, hi, Doctor. How are you? Parker! Exciting news. Come by the lab. Uh, like, now? This is my divining moment. Can't wait to show you. Cool. Um, I've got dinner plans. Can I come by later? Dinner can wait. You need to see this, Peter. Uh, okay. Be right there. Missed another call from Doc. Peter, I wanted to make sure you're still available. I can't pay you yet, but I've pulled enough strings to keep the wolves from the door a bit longer. If we can get up and running, I know this new version of the project will attract investment. Massive investment. Stay ready. Fingers triple cross, Doc.
Hey, doctor. Hello, Peter. I'll be just a minute. Wow. Look at all this new stuff. We really need to get better about organizing our workspace. Where did you get all this equipment? Called in every last favor. Took out a few loans. It's like we're starting over once again. But this time's going to be different. Our first volunteer subject, Lance Corporal Texador. Lost his arm overseas and now just wants to hug his daughter again. You've been busy. Just getting started. You know, until now, we've been looking at prosthetics from the wrong perspective. Why restore people to what they were when we can make them better? Okay. I think that should do it. You ready? Everything okay? Damn it! This is all your fault, Norman, you son of a... Well, I know who you're not voting for in the next election. Sorry. I, uh, have a habit of making bad jokes in tense situations. <laughs> uh, it was a good joke, Parker. Just a bit of an overreaction on my part. No, don't worry. Uh, why don't you take a break? I'll, uh, I'll clean this up and uh, get us ready for another test. So, uh, hope you don't mind me asking, but it seems you and Norman have a bit of a history. We were lab partners in college. Became friends. Decided to start a business. We both had visions of changing the world just in different ways. Wait, you were at Oscorp when it started? I'm half the reason it's called Oscorp. In grad school, everyone called us the O's. <sighs> Add Corp to that, and well, it is a catchy name. Well, why'd you leave? Norman became more and more obsessed with genetics. He started a project I considered unethical. And there was this... Anyway, lawyers got involved. I chose to leave in exchange for a settlement. But that money didn't last very long. I've relied on grants ever since. If this project doesn't work... Don't worry. It'll work. Uh, let, me, let me just fix this up. I'll brew some fresh coffee. Be sure to run a diagnostic on the control unit. Could be a short. Oh, I'm so happy I could skip these. Yup. Oh. Why don't you do the honors this time? I think we did it. Next step, neural interface. That's a lot of work for you to do by yourself. You sure you can handle it? Apparently not, judging by today's debacle. Because I still haven't found another job. My funds are still... I know. It's okay. Don't worry, I'll figure it out. What's a few bucks when you're trying to change the world, right? To changing the world. Missed call from MJ. 
Doctor, I need to go, but I'll be back later. Don't worry, the work will still be here when you get back. Okay. What's that? What? What did you see? I'm curious. Oh my god, there's a lot of things to interact with. Parker, we've been focused on limb replacement. Connecting nerves at severed extremities, replicating the function of lost appendages. But what if instead, we gave people something they've never seen? Something straight from the mind. Unchain all of us from the bodies we've been born with, and instead, unleash the awesome power of our minds. Okay, sounds cool, I guess. Oh. Uh, yeah, I don't feel like doing this right now. <laughs> I don't feel like doing it ever. Uh, I wonder if I could 3D print a web shooter. I can't believe I've never tried that. What is this stuff, Doc? Looks like armored plating. Defense prototypes. Fascinating, really. AIM has requested a number of samples of my work. Who am I to deny them my genius? Ha! Ah, kidding, of course. Doc's working on some kind of advanced hypodermic delivery system. Maybe to help with implant rejection? I don't know, that's a big needle. Wait, is this the raft? Are you doing work for the Supermax prison? Indeed. They're soliciting bids to modernize their security grid. Figured I'd try my hand. Lucrative contract and a satisfyingly difficult nut to crack. Okay. I mean, if I mean, you're smart enough, you're probably the one to figure out how to do it. Hey, sorry I missed your call. We still on for dinner? Dinner? Oh, yeah. I was calling you about something else, but yeah, we should talk over dinner. Offer still stands for me to come over and cook. Oh, really? Well, I like to take risks. I'm still out, but I'll grab some stuff at the store and let you know when I'm home. Okay, talk soon. All right, dinner at MJ's. Low expectations. It'll be hard to screw this one up. Guess I'll just freelance for a while until she calls. Explore the cities, upgrade your gear and abilities. Yeah, you see, the thing is, though, I mainly just want to focus on the main story. I literally just want to focus on the main story. So, can she hurry up at the store? You know? Uh, what the fuck is going on here? This whole street's blocked off. Okay. Um, but yeah, I just, I just want to focus on the main story. But I guess we have some extra shit to do. Might as well stop a crime if we can, right? Uh, wait, what the fuck? Is it on the roof? Where is this crime happening? Oh, fuck. Um... Demons are turning the city into a war zone. So are you guys terrorists or criminals? Because I can't keep it straight. I don't know what the fuck I'm doing over here. Um, I gotta be honest, I wasn't expecting to run into this. So, you know, that's what's happening. Dudes. Although it's kind of rude you didn't. Get a team over there. I want those demons questioned. Okay. You good? Seems like everybody's good. Okay. I guess on to the next crime? <laughs> I guess. All units be advised. Commercial robbery in progress. Where? Is ongoing near Union Square. Please oh. Copy. Is it this? Okay, sure. Let's, let's stop a robbery. Awesome. Oh my god, there's a lot of guys here. I thought it was just going to be like we one or three guys, right but okay. Service and knock out any criminals. It says so right on the sign. Okay. Not bad. Stop some crimes. Okay. Awesome. And I think I see a book bag. Coming, so back up I'm there. Going. 
So let's grab that backpack while we're here. Kill some time until they call us for the next mission. Attention uh, agents, this wait, is Control. Need wait, an update on the situation in Madison. Dude, just control, walk control, on the wall. What are you doing? My underarm webs. I thought they might help me glide short distances, but they never really worked. Looked cool, though. And it looks like they're going to work in the second game because Insomniac showed it off in the trailer. And I'm excited. I am so excited. Backpacks found. Two of 55. Um, okay, MJ, when, like, I just, when are we going to cook you dinner, huh? When is the next mission going to start, MJ? Huh? Are you going to hit us up? Yes? No? I mean, there's another backpack around here. I mean, I guess we could do it. Hey, MJ. All right, I picked up a bunch of stuff at the store. Can't wait to see what you come up with. Swinging over now. Prepare to be amazed. <laughs> Funny, my fear of heights didn't go away when I got my powers. Had to climb to the top of the Empire State to get over that. Okay, well, let's go make MJ some dinner. Oh, she's like right around the corner. Awesome. We actually don't have to swing that far. She's just right around the corner. Okay. Uh, let's, oop, there we go. Peter. You're not going to believe what happened. So you know that address you gave me? I went there. MJ. I know, I know, but wait. What is this? Just listen. This is the address Pete found. Men are all carrying firearms. What is this place? That office. Might be something inside that connects this to Lee. Need to get back there. Huh? What was that? What dumbass can't put their shit away? Better I just... Happy. I just... I can... Okay, great. I, I'm not looking forward... Almost uh... To this mission. Need can to we, get this guy out of my way. Well, I'm trying... Wait, Mark I'm trying to... Can we push this? We build this war beast for Lee. Okay. Lee finances the bosses. I hated these missions when I first played this game, and I'm not the only one. There was a lot of people that disliked these missions, so you know. Need to get into that office. Uh jeez. So what's the boss doing okay. money from his Lee job? What are they building? Is this all for Lee? I don't know what they're building, but let's try not to be seen. Careful. Oh, you tried any yet? Well, this okay. And let's go this way. Easy does it. Oh my God! What there are more vehicle needs tires this big. I'm guessing a Where big vehicle. Swear I don't know. There are more boxes here than a fucking Amazon warehouse. What the hell is going on here? Let's go around. Um, ah, shit on a stick. Uh, where exactly are we heading? I guess this way. There's glass there. What is this? Whose attention will this get? That guy's not going anywhere. Maybe I can distract him. Hey. Nope, you didn't see anything. You didn't see anything. What is this? Some kind of military hardware? That dude needs to turn around. A lot of men in the way, though. Okay. So far, so good. So far, so good. Let's head this way now. Oh my god, who almost saw us? I don't know who almost saw us, but okay. 
Those barrels seem important. Alchemax. Why is that so familiar? What's in these? Boss, come on! We'll never notice! Tombstone. You're right, Rick. Won't notice? Cause it won't be there. God damn it! I said I'll fix it! You got some stones, Rick. <laughs> Let's see if they break. Such a disappointment. And now I need a new welder. Yeah, but what if you get your head smashed in like that one dude? That's not great, right? Come on now. What was that? Okay, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. You didn't see shit. Let's just go. Made it. Dust must have me on edge. Blueprints. An APC. This is what they're building for Lee. But why does he need an armored feet? Here we go. GPS trackers. What is Tombstone using these for? All right, boys. Time to move. Get the gear for my office. Time to go. Okay, I want to say don't ever do that again, but since I know you're going to anyway, here. Take a few of those next time. Nice. Thanks. You know Tombstone is crazy and pretty much invincible, right? Everybody has their weakness. Mine is... whatever you're cooking right now. <laughs> it smells amazing. The chicken curry. Uh, just needs some time to simmer. No dumplings, I hope. You're never gonna let me live that one down, are you? Nope. <laughs> the Great Dumpling Catastrophe. I still can't believe they evacuated the entire building. I know, and in January, too. <laughs> Your neighbors hated me. Yeah, they were... Pretty happy when we broke up. <laughs> yeah. So, let's talk about what you found in Lee's office. Well, Lee clearly has issues with Norman Osborne. Yeah, but, but why? I don't know yet. But his next move looks like it involves Devil's Breath, whatever that is. Yeah. I'll dig into it. So I was thinking. What if we teamed up? What, what, you want to be my sidekick? Like a spider girl? Spider woman. No. Woman. No, not a sidekick. A partner. Oh. Not again. Ah. Hey, it's your crime system thingy. Looks like a residential break-in. <laughs> Charles Standish. Hmm. That sounds familiar. Oh! Oscorp CFO! Wait. You don't think this has anything to do with Lee, do you? Sorry to cook and run. Did... Did you just leave your clothes on the kitchen floor? Uh... Where, where do you want me to, uh... Just couch is fine. <laughs> yeah. See you later? Yeah.
Hey, it's me. This curry is legit. So what do we know about Charles Standish? Let's see. Chief Financial Officer at Oscorp. Single. Known for his art collection. If Lee's after him, it's gotta be related to Devil's Breath. I'll run a search on everything in that file. Let me know the second you find something. I think Lee might be planning something even worse than City Hall. So, are we partners now? Because it sure feels like we are. Partners? Uh, sounds good. Okay. See ya, partner. Police look like they could use some help. There's probably more of them inside. Stay here. Somebody was in a hurry. Spider-Man! You're hurt. I'm okay. But you gotta find Mr. Standish, fast. Those guys in the masks kidnapped him and forced him up to his place. He lives in the penthouse, top floor. Okay, sit tight. So glad you're here. I can't find my car. I could have sworn I parked on this level. Is that all of them? Oh no, there's a couple of guys left. Okay. Well. You guys work here too? This building is serious about parking enforcement. Fight! A for effort! The elevator won't work, they know I'm here. But maybe I can sneak up through the elevator shaft. Should be able to make it up to the penthouse from here. Okay, should I just run up the... Oh. <laughs> Okay, almost there. Stay out of the light. How big is this elevator shaft? That is my main question. How big is this fucking elevator shaft? I know they're gonna try to shoot at me, and I honestly don't care. Let's just go, let's just go, let's just go, let's just go, let's just go. Wait, no, what are you doing? Dude, there we go. 
nice and easy. Oh my god, how big is this elevator oh, shaft? Oh shit. Seriously? I guess they got tired of us running. Yep, they got tired of us running. Great. Not good. Dude, why just go? Wait, why didn't you just go? Okay, well, I guess I don't know. There's Standish. Okay, now what? Enter your password. He sounds nervous. Maybe I should take him out. Looks like this dude is alone. Shh. This is a nice apartment. Look at this place. This is nice. This is really nice. Okay. Uh, is, I think that is that guy safe? I don't think he is. Yes, no. Okay, I know for a fact this dude is safe, right? You safe? Yeah. Um, how many more guys are there? I don't exactly know, but let's get rid of this dude who's carrying, what was it, like an axe or, um, what is it called? That thing that you always see death depicted as using, is it like a, I don't know what, what it's called, but that, that weird sharp looking thing. Okay, so we got him. Now there's these two guys. Uh, I'm gonna try to get one of them to go this way. Or look that way, I should say. Okay, and then. Oh, more guys just got here. Isn't that lovely? And then I don't know if this dude no he he's not alone. Okay, that's that's lovely. Um shit. Uh hmm. Can you guys like go that look that way? No one heard that? Okay. Time. Okay, all clear. Hope Standish is all right. Try this again. It's safe now. What were they after? Just financial records. About Devil's Breath? How do you know about that? Why do they want it? I don't even know what it is. Mr. Osborne's been pouring money into it for years, but he keeps the whole project a secret. I'm the only one who has any record of it. Not anymore. Looks like they copied some records to a secure server. Payroll information. 
on a Dr. Isaac Delaney. Who is he? I, I honestly don't know. Down! <laughs> Come on, come on! Wait, the elevator! <laughs> Hold on! <laughs> Almost got him! Try to fall slower! You okay? Yeah. I think so. Good. Good. You know, as elevator shafts go, this is pretty nice. <laughs> hey, Yuri. You okay? Yeah. But I didn't get much out of Standish before these Sable guys stepped in and told me to back off. What's the deal? I get the sense all they care about is keeping him quiet. Because he knows about Devil's Breath. Right. Whatever the hell that is. I'm working on that. I think I just got a lead. A lead? You sound like a cop. Don't you mean... Spider Cop? Uh, Yuri? That's fair. Peter, what happened with Standish? He's safe. Okay, good. They were looking for a name. You got a pen? Yeah, go. Dr. Isaac Delaney. Okay. Who is he? What's his deal? I was hoping you could tell me. I'm on it. Just give me a few. Oh, and before I forget, you left that tracker from Tombstones at my place. I'll drop it at Dr. Octavius's lab. Let you know what I find on Delaney. New side mission unlocked. Great. Even though I really haven't been doing them, but thanks, I guess? I just, I don't know, I, I I just want to focus on the main story because I'm honestly replaying this uh, mainly because I wanted to replay it on the channel because like I mentioned, I feel like my recording quality has improved and also my voice recording quality has improved and also because I kind of wanted to, uh, whatchamacallit, um, refresh my, my memory a little bit because I, um, I couldn't, you know, I just wanted to refresh my, my memory a little bit before Spider-Man 2 comes out uh oh i don't want to get this yeah i want to, i definitely want to get that definitely want to get that um what is this you know that could be useful um throw cannot be viewed in the moves list and we only have one skill point available combo booster let's get that too okay awesome um also we unlock this suit I freaking love this suit. I don't know why, I just kind of vibe with it. Mainly because, I guess, Converse are my favorite sneakers out there. They're my favorite shoes. So, um, you know, Spider-Man wearing Converse is kind of cool to me. <laughs> Anyways, um, what are we supposed to do? Are we supposed to do side missions now until the next main mission is available? Should I just stand here and wait until the next main mission is available? Actually, you know what? If we're going to have to wait to do the next main mission, why don't we just quickly swing over here and do this uh, surveillance tower, right? I mean, we have to wait for the next mission anyway, so might as well do that surveillance tower. Also, let me make sure I'm recording. I am recording. Okay, good. I'm just a little bit paranoid. Update on the situation um, in Clinton. So let's just oh, go right. ahead and do that surveillance right. tower and uh, wait for them to call us for the next main mission right we're not getting much coverage i should look for more towers to activate dude that's exactly what oop. that is exactly what we're doing we're right next to a tower okay hey do you have time to check something out for me no but if you ask nicely just got a call about a suspicious looking box on a rooftop in hell's kitchen i could call in the bomb squad but if it's just some kid's science project yeah i know budget crisis yada 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 so <sighs> Will you please check it out? There's the magic word. I hope it's some kid's science project. Man, I miss those days. School projects are so much easier than real life projects. 
Okay. We're done with Hell's Kitchen. Great. Um, now where the fuck do we have to go? We have to go all the way over here. I'm just gonna fast travel here. <laughs> make make our life a little bit easier. Hey, I got a business problem. And that's that. Every crime tower in the city's now repaired. Pretty good work, right? Pretty good, yeah. Good enough that maybe you'd let a certain someone celebrate with us? <sighs> Fine, but make it quick. The odds were long, the danger close. But between Spider Cop's reckless intuition and the Chief's determined planning, they got the job done. Aw, that's kind of sweet. A pairing of opposites, like peanut butter and chocolate, or breakfast for dinner. The two work together. And we're done. Talk to you later, Spider Cop. She's coming around, right? Yeah, definitely. Hmm. Looks military grade. Weird. Spider Man, so you found one of my recon points. Who is this? Wrong question. The correct one is Can you stop the bombs I've planted? Mystery Man's got recon points spread all over the city. If I remember correctly, I absolutely hated doing these things because I think you have to get ultimate level for every single one of them in order to get a trophy. And like I mentioned, I platinumed this game. So I had to go around to every single one of these things and do them over and over and over again until I got ultimate level, which is like the best you could do, the best score you could do. And some of them were pretty difficult. And I remember being so angry. Um, but then when I popped that trophy, I, it was, I, I felt very accomplished. An armed mugging was just reported. Need a unit on scene. Witness reported location at the yards. I'm not doing that right now. I am not doing that right now. Can they just call us and tell us that the next main mission is going to be available? Please and thank you. <laughs> and also, how did she mistake that for a kid's science project? That looks scary. That is not some kid's like science project. I, I don't know. But you know what? Let's just stop this crime. Where the hell is this crime? Yeah, let's stop this crime. Um, Muggers, gotta jump in. Oh, what the fuck? Missed a call from Aunt May. Peter, I spoke to Miles' mother, and she loved the idea of him working here. Oh, the poor woman's grieving herself while trying to be strong for her son. She needs some time to just grieve, and he needs to see that life's still worth living. That was a very thoughtful suggestion, Peter. The kind that would have made Ben proud. Oh, that's nice. That's sweet. Um, also, one of our backpacks are around here. Ground teams, this is stable control. What's our status? MJ, what did you find out about Isaac Delaney? Check out the picture I just sent. Which one is Delaney? I don't know. Guess you'll have to go to the party to find out. Good thing I already have a costume. Okay. Well, I guess we're going to a party. That sounds like fun. Halloween party. Guess I don't have to change. Delaney's dressed as one of my greatest foes. Let's find out which one. Okay. Well, I'm not seeing anyone here. Oh, look. There's a couple of Spider-Man. <laughs> That's funny. Everyone's in costume. My people. So it's a Halloween night. That's fun. Now there's a guy who puts in the effort. Badass. Dr. Delaney is here somewhere. I have to find him before Lee does. There's no Broadway in Delaware. No culture. Hey, look at us. We're Spider Bros. 
Yeah. <laughs> That's awesome, dude. The white spider. Excuse me. Are you Dr. Delaney? Oh, Spider-Man, my nemesis. You won't catch me this time. <coughs> oh no, smoke. Whatever will I do? Okay. This is the end for you, Spider-Man. Which one is the real man? <laughs> no, I have you. Hey, what's wrong with you? I worked on that helmet for a week. I need to find Dr. Delaney. He's out in the party somewhere. Who are you? I'm your friendly neighborhood Spider-Man. Huh, <laughs> smart ass. Well, sorry. It doesn't look broken, calm down. It really doesn't look broken. It's okay. Exactly. Is it that dude? That guy throwing down candy could be Dr. Delaney. Gotta find a way up there. What's back here? What is this? Can't use my webs. Oh, okay. I'm looking for Isaac Delaney. I think he's on the dance floor. There he is. The lizard in the lab coat. Okay, can you guys, like, get out of my way? How do I get up there? How do I get up to the dance floor? Okay, I see. Hey, look, it's Spider-Boy! Since I'm one of your nemesises, we gotta uh, fight! Maybe later. Oh, what's the matter, Spider-Wimp? You afraid of my mighty horn? Hey, who? What, what are you... Come on! Hey, fight! Uh, Kick fight. his ass, Spider-Man! <laughs> What the hell? Oh, snap! Oh my god. Is that the real Spider-Man? <laughs> I'm totally live streaming this right now! Uh, get him, Spidey! Yeah. Ooh! What do you want? what you want this is a joke right those aren't real guns back now <gasps> let him go Everybody okay? Yeah. Good. Uh, happy Halloween. How about some mood lighting? I thought I could do this stealthily. Well, you know, I tried. I fucking tried. Oh my god. <laughs> you guys are being rude right now. <laughs> like, so fucking rude. Let me, sh you know, let me take you guys down. Um, please and thank you. Oh, 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 fuck. Okay, okay. You guys clearly don't want to be taken down, which I find so rude and disrespectful. Like, you know, I'm just trying to you know, take down the bad guys. Let me do what I need to do. You know, I'll, I promise I'll try to make it not hurt. And where'd they take Delaney? They're 
Dr. Delaney. Where are you taking me? recently began working with someone in an Oscorp lab. How do, you, how do you know that? We don't have much time, Isaac. Tell me his name. Show's over, Lee. Apparently the show's not over. His name, Dr. Morgan Michaels. Thank you. Is that all of them? That's all of them. Gotta find Lee. Yuri, I need your help. I've got reports of shots fired at ESU. Yeah, that's me. I'll explain later. But right now, you need to find a Dr. Morgan Michaels. Martin Lee's coming after him. Copy that. Spider-Man, who is this Dr. Michaels? I think he's the head scientist on this Devil's Breath project. Did you find him? Yes and no. Sable says they have him under protection at a safe house somewhere in the city, but they won't tell me where. I thought you guys were working together. So did I. Okay. I have an idea on how to find him. I'll let you know if it works. What's the idea? Are we expecting a phone call? 1034. Shots fired. Hey, did you find Dr. Delaney at the party? 
Yeah, but so did Lee. Oh no, what happened? Lee corrupted him and made him kill himself. That's horrible. We have to stop this guy. We will. Before Delaney died, he gave Lee a name. Morgan Michaels. Morgan Michaels? Who is he? Not sure, but I bet he works on the Devil's Breath project. Have you learned anything from that Devil's Breath file? Yeah, get this. A few years ago, Osborne came to Fisk and asked him to build a lab, but to keep it hidden from regulators. Secret lab? For Devil's Breath? If it's as dangerous as we think it is, I can see why. Where's the lab? It's not in the file. Osborne made Fisk destroy all records of it. All I have are invoices from Osborne's personal account to Fisk Construction. Knowing Fisk, he kept the invoices around for blackmail material on the mayor. Everything leads back to Norman Osborne. Guess it's time to pay him a visit. I doubt he's gonna tell you anything. Wasn't planning to ask. Okay, that's how I can get into Norman's office. Can't get in there without shutting down some security systems. But if they see me, they'll put the whole place on lockdown. I should be able to hack into the security network modules from the outside. There are the network cables. Just need to follow them to the security module. Uh, well, there's lights here. It heads to this lights as well. Uh... Oh. There we go. A security module. Looks like there's four of these around the building. That should make things easier. What the hell? Security teams, call in. Sable Team Alpha standing by. Looks like an electrical problem. Copy that. Keep an eye on the exterior while we try to track down the issue. Just when I thought it would be easy. Okay. So just, just avoid these lights as if they were, you know, lasers in a James Bond movie, right? That sounds easy enough. Oh, even though there's one right there. Uh, let's go this way. Oh, no. Wait, can you? Okay, there we go. Let's go this way now. Oh, All stable great. teams. Looks like we have some sort of software problem. We're calling in a specialist. Copy that. Continuing exterior sweep. You don't. You don't got to. You don't. You don't really have to do that. You know. There's the second module. What? All agents. Someone's taking control of one of our subsystems. Initiating Delta Protocol. Man, everybody's got drones these days. Fable teams, I need a status report. Exterior sweep negative. We are all clear. Still look like a software issue? We don't know. We're evaluating. Please maintain current alert level. Okay, just two more modules. Attention all Sable teams. There's a small possibility we have a trespasser on site. We're analyzing data now. Stay vigilant. Copy that, Control. There it is. Damn it. Another subsystem is going offline. I need a team to scan the 85th floor exterior. Copy, Control. Bird inbound. Gotta move. Hi, MJ. A little busy right now. I'll be quick. Listen, I got a lead on Charles Standish's location. I think if I can get to him, I can make him talk. He knew about Dr. Delaney. He probably knows about Morgan Michaels as well. Okay, just don't do anything crazy. Speaking of crazy, I gotta find that last module. There's the last one. Now I can get into Norman's office and hopefully find out more about Morgan Michaels and Devil's Breath. Exterior sweep negative. Should we go on lockdown? Not yet. Mr. Osborne is in the middle of an important call, but keep tracking. There must be someone out there. Okay. I'm surprised we didn't get caught. Um, but you know, I'm not gonna complain. Hold Definitely on. not gonna complain. To I'm way ahead of you, Wilson. I had my people go through all your files. If you try to expose our business arrangement, it'll be your word against mine. 
And I'm not the one behind bars right now. Wait, is Norman talking to Wilson Fisk? Neo statue. What are you talking about? The Neo statue from the auction house. They must be talking about that file MJ found. Who has the file? We do, Norman. But it doesn't tell us enough. Which is why I'm doing some slightly illegal but morally acceptable B&E right now. I'm the son of a bitch! You're lying! Ah, oh, don't be too mad, Norman. We know you and Fisk built a secret Devil's Breath lab, but we still don't know where it is and what Michaels has to do with it. Let's hope your computer can tell us more. You know, I'm not a huge Marvel fan. I'm more of a DC fan. I love Wonder Woman, Batman, Superman, all that shit. Um, but Spider-Man is definitely my favorite Marvel superhero. And I think Insomniac did such an amazing job with this game. I really, really hope that eventually they get to do a game of all the Avengers, which I know might take time to give each Avenger their own game. I know they're making a Wolverine one, but man, I, re I really, really would love to see Insomniac's take on the Avengers. Because I mean, look at that. Look at that right there. Like their tower is right there. Like I'm pretty sure Iron Man is in there and Black Widow and Thor. Like, they're all in there, I bet. Right? They have to be. <laughs> GR-27. Hmm. Dr. Morgan Michaels is the chief scientist, but the location of the lab is redacted. AI-controlled CRISPR? If that actually works, it could cure any genetic disease. Cystic fibrosis? Huntington's? This is crazy. Creepy. Whoa. GR-27 is Devil's Breath. It's designed to cure diseases, but in its current form, it's like a bioweapon. Dr. Michaels keeps the only sample with him at all times. That's why Lee wants him. We find Michaels, we find Devil's Breath. MJ, get this. Devil's Breath wasn't designed to be a weapon. It's a treatment for genetic disorders. But its current form is wildly imperfect. In trying to fix the body, it rips it apart. We need to locate Dr. Michaels. I don't trust Sable to contain something this deadly. I may have a lead on that. Charles Standish is being held at Sable's Central Park compound. If anyone knows Michaels' location, it'll be Oscorp CFO. I'm trying to reach him now. Reach him? That place is crawling with guards. How are you trying to reach him? Very, very quietly. Gotta go, partner. Sneaking into a Sable compound. That could go bad fast. I should head to Central Park. I mean, well, luckily Central Park is right there. Looks like Doc checked in. Peter, I've had an epiphany. It's all about the mind. Take me, for example. A mind of unlimited potential shackled to a tired old body. Think of what that mind could achieve if it were freed. In developing our neural interface, we need to think beyond replicating the tired putterings of our physical forms. Instead, reach into imagination and possibility. Reach into the mind. I've never heard Doc this excited by a project. Hope he's not too excited. Okay. Uh, well, we're here. Are you, MJ? Crap. Reach him? That place is crawling with guards. How are you trying to reach him? Very, very quietly. Gotta go, partner. Stand is just somewhere in there. Gotta get past that guard. Time to see if these lures Pete gave me work. That gap at the fence looks promising. Just need to distract the guard. Out of the way, Phil. What was that? Gotta move. Now. Gonna check on our house guest. Stay here. Copy. 
house guest. Must be Standish. He's here somewhere. Uh. Okay, where are we supposed to try to make this person move? Need to uh, draw him away from the stairs. Shit. Can we make him actually move a little bit more this way? No, that gets that dude's attention. Okay. Hopefully that's good enough. What's that? Demons are killing anyone related to Devil's Breath. Standish is in real danger. Got it. Time to move. Standish. I knew it. I've got to get to that tent. Oh, great. Okay. Yeah, I seriously hope we don't get more of these type of missions in the second game. And, you know, if they do decide to put some of these missions in there, I hope it's like one, maybe, just one. Standish is secure, ma'am. Lockout comms as well. I do not want leaks to press about Michael's or Devil's breath. On it. She's nervous. Crap. Generator tripped. I won't distract him for long. Shit, this dude is looking this way. Can you look somewhere else, please and thank you? Like, uh, I don't know, that way? Okay. Great. <sighs> Made it. Made it where? This is not where I was supposed to go, is it? What? What is this? Okay, I think I'm in the wrong place. Or maybe I'm not, actually. Let's go up here. I didn't see these stairs at first. Bravo and Charlie are both on deck for Dr. Michael's relocation, ma'am. Add two more units. He carries the only sample of Devil's Breath. I will not be responsible for pandemic. So far, so good. Looks important. Safe houses. If Dr. Michaels is in one of these, Standish might know which one. Gotta move. There's Standish's tent. Can't believe Michaels just carries Devil's Breath around with him. Osborne doesn't trust anyone else to secure it. Hope his ego doesn't bite him in the ass. For us. Again? Where am I supposed to go? Shit, I don't... Am I supposed to go in between those two tents over there? Oh, this is not good. I don't know exactly where I'm supposed to go. Uh... Maybe I am supposed to go in between those two tents. Okay. Um... Control. I heard something. Running okay. Away. Great. And then... Let's go this way. And then can we make him look this way? Control. I heard something. Running yeah, yeah, you did. Okay. Now let's go this way. Almost there. Nothing. Sector's clear. Oh shit. Um, I should have moved with the truck. Should have moved with the truck, but I um I panicked a little. Control. Clear. Control. I heard something. Running a sweep. OK. 
Okay. Can we enter through the back of this thing? Or is it just the front? Apparently, it's just the front. Okay. Don't usually tents have, like, two entrances, right? Like, I'm not crazy to think that, right? Tents usually have two entrances, right? Uh... Could really use a coffee. Charles Standish? Holy crap! Charles, where is Dr. Morgan Michaels? Lee sent you. Didn't he? No. Okay. He wants to kill me? He told him to do it. Do it himself. I'm not with the demons. I'm not with Sable. I'm a reporter. And I want to see Lee stopped. Just like you. What? I've heard your byline. Sable won't listen to me. She has Michaels in the Bowery. They're moving him to a new safe house tomorrow at noon. But she's totally ignoring Grand Central. Grand Central? The demons were talking about it when they held me. They're going there to get... To get what, Charles? What do the demons need to get at Grand Central? <laughs> what the... Oh, what that the was hell? not a sable guy. Definitely not a sable guy. Sorry, Charlie. Okay, time to Wait, go. No, he knows something. <laughs> well, that was maybe the most awkward swing of my life. MJ is not happy. Yeah, I do not think she's happy at all. A skill point has been acquired. That's awesome. Hey, okay, another thing. Sorry, Charlie. You knock a man out, destroy my background research, and the best you've got is sorry, Charlie? Is everything a joke to you? What? MJ, no, I screwed up. It was a tension breaker. Tension breaker, right. You know, this is exactly why we broke up. I... I thought we broke up so you could focus on your career. We broke up because you wouldn't stop treating me like a baby. Don't do this, MJ. Don't do that, MJ. Oh, that's too dangerous, MJ. I may not have super spider powers, but I'm not made out of glass. You snuck into the middle of an armed military... You know what? Can we not do this right now, please? Did you learn anything about Dr. Michaels? <sighs> Fine. <sighs> Michaels is in the Bowery somewhere. Sable's moving him tomorrow at noon. Awesome. Anything else? Was he saying something about Grand Central before I jumped in? He was... No. It was nothing. Listen, I gotta go, Peter. Filing deadline. Peter. That's how you know she's still mad. Peter. Nice work, Mr. Superhero. Well, you know what? Man, I'm worked up. Gotta blow off some steam on patrol. To be fair... To be fair, all Peter saw was a gun being pointed at her. So, you know, you can't really get mad at him for jumping in when he did. All he saw was a gun being pointed at her. So, you know what? I, I don't blame him at all. So, yeah. <laughs> uh, oh, this could be useful. Yeah, that could be useful. Uh, oh, we can't afford any of these. We could afford this one. Yeah, you know, let's get this one. Why not? And then it looks like we unlocked a new suit. We unlocked this one and this one. Oh, God, this one is kind of ugly, too. A lot of these suits, I don't know. I don't... Uh, I don't um, vibe with some of these suits. Like this one. What is this? Like, what is this? Uh, this one looks cool, but I think this one's from the movies, right? With... Um, Tom Holland? Yeah, I think so. Anyways, what are we supposed to do? We're just gonna wait until they call us for the next mission? I think so. <laughs> um, 
Okay, sounds like a plan. I don't know exactly what we're gonna do. Maybe we should just collect more book bags. I feel like that is the quickest thing to do. So let's grab more book bags. Stable teams, this is Control. What's our status in Nolita? Demons are firing on our APC. Use these electrician's gloves in my first fight with Electro. Give me the idea to add insulation to my costume, which saved my bacon more than once. Are there more backpacks near us? I like collecting the backpacks because it gives us a little bit of like more backstory into Peter. Miles, it's mom. Hello? Mr. Parker? It's Drio Morales. I want to thank you for getting Miles the job at the feast shelter. Glad to. And please call me Peter. Mr. Parker is probably someone more together than me. I should tell you, he has reservations. I finally gave him a choice. This or more therapy. He needs this. He just hates to feel like a victim or be pitied. Gotcha. I'm the same way. I'll let Aunt May know, and I'll make sure I'm there his first day. Thank you again. This means a lot to both of us. My ESU ID badge from my semester as a teaching assistant. Didn't have time to stick with it, but I could definitely see teaching again someday. Okay. Teaching assistant. See, like, we learn more about Peter and what he used to do. So I kind of like getting the backpacks because of that, because now we know he used to be a teacher's assistant. Um, we know about the gloves. You know, that's why I like collecting these things. Aunt May's recipe for wheat cakes. <laughs> I could never make it work on my own. Again... I probably should have Googled this after the first part of this Let's Play, but what the fuck is wheat cake? That sounds dry and not appetizing, if I'm being honest. That does not sound appetizing at all. Wheat cake? I just... I... I don't know. That does not sound appetizing at all. In my opinion. I, I think that does not sound appetizing at all. Demons are firing on TCP Bravo. Need backup. Okay. Where's this one? Oh. People know my parents died in a plane crash. I still can't tell anyone they were government agents. Wish I knew more about them. I wish anyone did. Wait, what? Did he just say government agents? Why don't... You know, to be fair, when I was collecting these to get the trophy, I was just grabbing them and I ran to the next one, grabbed it, ran to the next one, grabbed it. I really didn't pay attention to what he said. His parents were government agents that died in a plane crash? Did I hear that correctly? People know my parents died in a plane crash. I still can't tell anyone they were government agents. I wish I knew more about them. I wish anyone did. Government agents? Huh. I seriously hope we learn more about that in the second game. I find that really, really interesting. Like, how... Because they were government agents, did they die in a plane crash that was accident like like that would I, that was actually caused by like a bad person was it on purpose i'm interested i'm very very interested now i want to know more about that i am super interested about that i want to know more about his parents and their death i'm curious i'm very very curious peter i'm about to begin another test Oh, sorry. My bus broke down and uh, there were no cabs, but I'll be there as soon as I can. Hey, sorry I'm late. Morning, Parker. Or is it evening? That doesn't matter. Check the neurosensors, would you? We need a faster response time. On it. Try to get it under three milliseconds. Okay, let's 
Looks like I could optimize this power relay. Nice. Okay, what next? It looks like some impedance in this neurosensor circuit. Finished. Signal to noise is out of whack. A new signal processor should reduce lag. I got it, Doc. 2.8 milliseconds. Good work, Peter. I call that a mild success. I call that unbelievable. Do you need some help? Yes. Doctor, what's going on? It's become that obvious. My doctors call it a degenerative neurological disorder. Probably caused by overexposure to toxic chemicals in my reckless youth. Sorry, is, is, is there anything I can do? You already are. The worst part is, it only affects the muscles. The mind continues to work, but... it can no longer do. You're the only one who knows, Peter. I'd like to keep it that way. Of course. Ah, uh, if you'd like to seek a position with more of a future. I, I came here to work for you because of what you've got up here. And that's not going anywhere. So neither am I. Oh, Peter, before I forget, I read the most fascinating article. Outlines possible next steps for the neural interface. I'll take a look. Thanks, Doc. Uh, where? Oh, there's stuff everywhere. What is this, Doc? Never seen this type of material. Would you believe it's for welding? Provides remarkable magnetic insulation and limits cross-contamination between the neural interface and arms. Doc loves these things. He used them in grad school when he had to manipulate radioactive isotopes. Says seeing them keeps him humble. Okay, nice goggles. Love that. Man, I remember the first day I interviewed here. I showed up with stains on my shirt, ten minutes late from stopping a mugging. Still can't believe Doc hired me. Hope he doesn't regret it now. Hmm. 
Peter is starting to suspect. He hides it, but I can tell. He's seen my twitch, noticed the decay of my fine motor control. Well, I'm the one who wanted a genius for an assistant. Of course he knows. <sighs> I just need more time. My work can improve millions of lives. Save millions of lives. It can also save my own. I just need more time. Direct interface with the basal ganglia. Exciting, but risky. I don't know, Doc. You'll need a gallium silk array to make it work. Even then, odds of injury are pretty high. Gallium! Genius! Never mind the risks. We'll work them out in time. Doc's really sick. At this rate, he'll lose control of his motor functions within a year. And if we're not careful, an intracranial implant could make things even worse. Even alter his personality. We need to proceed carefully. Um, Doc, I'm sorry. My aunt just texted. No worries, Peter. I was thinking of taking a break myself. As soon as I check our telemetry data. Thanks. I'll be back in a few hours. Thank you again, Peter. Don't know what I'd do without you. Um, okay. I feel bad for him. I honestly do. I feel bad for him. Uh, these... Yeah, I'm not gonna interact with these things. I already interacted with this, right? Doc's really doubling down on defense contracts. Hopefully the neural prosthetic will work, so he doesn't have to sell his soul to keep the lights on. Hmm. Yeah. Let's get out of here. Strong connections complete. Hi, May. Let me guess, running late? Nope, I'm actually on my way now. Have you heard from Miles? No, but his mother said he was coming, so... Good, I'll be there soon. Bye. What are you doing here? Whoa, we got a fighter. <laughs> You just made your last mistake, punk. What the? Does it seriously take this many guys to rob a teenager? Spider-Man. You're the amazing Spider-Man. You're the spectacular Spider-Man. And a few other choice adjectives Jameson uses. Look, that was really brave. But next time, leave the fighting to the pros. Okay? Uh, okay, but what if there aren't any around? Well, you can't just go swinging at someone twice your size. I mean, don't get me wrong. I fight guys stronger than me all the time. But when I do it, I have... Oh, like that time you fought Ryan on the Brooklyn Bridge? That was so awesome. Perfect example. <laughs> The other guy's bigger, you gotta be quicker. Okay? Okay, but that's, that's easy for you to say. I, sorry, I just can't do what you do. All right, put him up. Seriously? Yeah, come on. First thing, don't let the adrenaline get to you. Breathe slow, breathe deep, relax. Hip square to your opponent. Let them make the first move. Now use your feet, and when they go off balance, look for an opening. Boom. Like that? Yeah. Yeah, that's it. Okay. Not only this time, just let me have it. Right on the jaw. Okay? I can take it. Oh, sh... S sorry No, no. No. It's all good. You keep that up, and uh, you'll be fine. 
All right. Lesson's over. Gotta go. Hey, uh... Thanks. You know, anytime. I just punch Spider-Man. Shelter should be just ahead. Yo, Miles, what's up? Bro, you're not gonna believe this. I just met Spider-Man. What? That's crazy. Hey, did you show him our hacking app? Oh, man. I totally forgot. Oh, you suck. He totally would've bought it off you, and then we'd be, like, famous. Yeah, I'll show him next time. I, I gotta go. I promised my mom I wouldn't be late. Cool. Later. Keep moving. Keep moving. Man, I hope they're okay. I can't believe you're trying to be right side of a terrorist attack. Well, when you say it like that, how would you say it? Huh, hacking app. I wonder if it still works. Kidding me? It's gonna take forever. That drone wasn't watching. I could jump the fence. I just need to isolate the drone signal. Wow, that was too easy. I can't believe Sable systems are unsecured. Maybe I'll send an anonymous tip. Okay, hackney app. Don't fail me now. Did that? Okay. What else can I hack? Oh. Under the gate on the left, or over the scaffolding to the right. Oh, the scaffolding will work. Okay. You're so far, so You're good. Fine. More drones? Gotta blind them. Those things have mounted guns? I can't let them spot me. Can I not hack that one? Oh no! Wait, I hacked it. Nighty night. Oh, this will be so cool. It's less terrifying. Whoa! What? <gasps> no, I jumped before he noticed. I promise I clicked X before he noticed. That was bullshit. I clicked X before he noticed. I know it. I know it in my heart. I know it in my heart. I clicked X before he noticed. Whatever. Whatever. Those have mounted guns? I can't let them spot me. <clears throat> oh no! Wait. Maybe okay. Night. This will be so cool. It was less terrifying. Come on. Ignore me. I'm invisible. <clears throat> okay. I'm in the clear. Phew. That was intense. Oh. Hey, Mom. Hi, honey. Did you make it to the feast shelter okay? Uh, yeah. Almost there. Miles, you don't have to work at that shelter, you know. You said I did. No, I gave you a choice. Yeah, and I chose this over more therapy. I mean, it was helpful. The guy said everyone grieves in their own way. And this is mine. Okay. Sorry. Mom. Yeah? Just because I don't want to talk about it doesn't mean I don't love you. Love you so much. We'll get through this, okay? I gotta go. I'll call you on my way home. You know what? Just keep breathing. I'll be back soon, Mr. Hunter. Hey, hey, Miles. Pete. Hey, um, sorry I'm late, man. Oh, no, no. I'm just glad you're here. All right, so, um,. What can I do to help? Why don't you start just by, uh, getting comfortable with the place. Uh, meet a few people. You know what? Everybody loves coffee. Coffee? All right. And I'll be back in a little while to check on you. Is that cool? Yeah. Oh, don't worry about Mr. Hodges. He doesn't bite. Much. You sure?
Coffee? Thanks. Need help? Not unless you know what the hell a quark is. It's a subatomic particle. You know, the building block of protons, neutrons, hadrons? Subatomic? It fits. Good one, kid. Piece of junk. <clears throat> oh, hell. Damn hunk of junk. Uh, you mind if I take a look? Huh? Oh, we have a couple of CRTs at school. I know how to fix these CR when they're... What, what? No, no, you just gotta smack it. Got the time. Get it. Go it. Or, could be a loose coax cable. <sighs> all right, all right. Be my guest, huh, Mr. Smarty Pants? Hey, please, go ahead. Tributes continue to pour in for Officer Jefferson Davis, the hero killed in the City Hall bombing, as reports emerge that he used his own body to shield others in his last moments of life. Hey, new kid. I'm empty here. Hero. Man didn't do nothing heroic except get himself blown up. Hey, Ernie. I see you've met Miles. He's gonna be helping out around here. You may have heard of his father, Jefferson Davis. Pretty great that even though he's got a lot of stuff going on right now, he decided to come and volunteer. Don't you think? Uh, yeah, yeah. Um, thanks. Uh, listen, Kat, I'm, I'm... Sorry about your dad. Come on, Miles. Let's see if Ant-Man needs a hand in the kitchen. Hey, May. I gotta take off, but, uh... Brought some help for you. Hi, Miles. Nice to see you. Well, grab an apron, wash your hands, and I'll show you around. Hey, hey Peter. Um, thanks for that back there. Of course. Almost noon. Sable should be moving Dr. Michaels. Better get to the Bowery and locate him. I'm afraid our computers are a bit outdated. Oh, that's cool. I might be able to improve their performance for you. Really? That would be extremely helpful. Thank you. Okay. Um, let's go do what we gotta do. So how's it going with your daughter, Eileen? Slow. I made mistakes raising her. Hard to get past. If you're talking, there's hope. Don't give up. Now that's a wise man right there. Hey, Pete. Your aunt's really stepped up. Yeah, she's the best. First day complete. Okay. Awesome. So, where are we heading? Are we gonna have to, like, fool around a little bit before actually getting to do the next main mission? Hey, Yuri. I'm heading to the Bowery to make sure Michaels gets to his new safe house. You know, safely. I wouldn't do that. Silver Sable made it clear you are not welcome. Yeah, well, what you gonna do? Shoot me? Honestly, 50-50 chance. Ah, uh, fine. I'll be in the neighborhood, but not too close. Just in case. Dr. Michaels, is that the devil's breath? It's called GR-27, not... <sighs> Just be careful. In the wrong hands, this could... Don't worry, we're the best in the world. <sighs> I feel better already. Code 381, package is on the move. This way, Dr. Michaels. What the hell is that?
Welcome aboard, Doctor. Get off me! We got this! Yeah, sure you do. Martin Lee. I think he's got Dr. Michaels and the Devil's friends. Copy that. More units coming your way. He took Michaels alive, so that's good. Probably so we can force him to make more Devil's friends. I have to stop that truck. Tank, whatever. Clear the guys in the trucks before I go after Lee. and he will destroy all sinners! Sorry! Lee, hand it over! Become one of us. 
thanks, but no thanks! One way or the other, you will join me! Uh-oh. All the souls you've lost! The innocent victims you couldn't save! Martin, their blood is on your hands! You can stop Osborne. You have so much strength. I can give you will. Ow. Am I supposed to be hitting him? Because I'm just beating up the, like, the no-face enemies. Am I supposed to beat him up? Because I don't see a way for me to attack him. So, yeah, I don't know what I'm supposed to do here. These enemies just keep coming after us. So I don't know. Yeah, I don't know what I'm supposed to do here. This is not good. You okay? Did they take it? Yes. How worried should I be? Very. You're a popular guy. Where is the serum? I'm gone. The Discoya! So-called superhero. You think you save people, but you just make it worse. This is your fault. My fault? He was under your protection. You really need two of those? <laughs> Stop! We need to brief Mr. Osborne now. I'll go with her. Thank you. I'll remember this. Collision course complete. Yuri, tell me you've got a lead on Martin Lee's location. We have footage from a guy at a coffee shop. Looks like he hopped into a black sedan after the crash. Black sedan, great. Let me finish. We have a partial plate. And one of my patrol guys just found a matching plate. Black sedan in a parking lot near Canal and Hudson. You're a good cop, Yuri. I'm on my way. 
Spider-Man. Hello? Is this working? Dr. Michaels? How are you calling? Borrowed on one of Sable's radios. Listen, transit hubs are the most likely release points for Devil's Breath. Airports, bus terminals, train stations. It'll spread like wildfire from there. Why the hell is Oscorp developing a bioweapon in the city? Shouldn't this be in an Arctic bunker? Devil's Breath is personal for Norman. It's been his obsession for decades. The project breaks every state and federal regulation on the books, but he doesn't care. If the city finds out, we can kiss re-election goodbye. Oh, never mind re-election. He'd be tried in The Hague for war crimes. Why are you telling me all this? Aren't you just as culpable as Norman? Yes. Completely. But Lee's actions have been a wake-up call. We've ignored the project's risk for too long. I trust you, Spider-Man. You're the only one trying to do the right thing. Please, protect the city from our mistakes. Okay, sounds like a plan. Um, what are we... Okay, wait a minute. Do we have any skill points? Do we have any skill points? We have two, which isn't a lot. Surprise attack? That could be good. Yank and throw? That could also be good. Uh... Mm. Ooh, that could also be good. I don't know what I should get. I literally don't know what we should get. Maybe the surprise attack? Because we do a lot of stealth stuff. So maybe the surprise attack could be beneficial. So let's grab that. Okay. And then, um, ooh, looks like we unlocked a new suit. What did we unlock? This thing. I, again, a lot of these suits are so ugly. I, I, this, this, I think this suit is ugly too. I, guys, I don't know. Some of these suits are hella ugly in my personal opinion. I just, I don't like a lot of these. Okay, I had to pause the video real quick so I could get a glass of water because it's so hot in my room right now. It feels like a freaking oven in here. It is so hot in my room and I think it's because it's currently really, really hot in my city. I can't wait for winter. I honestly can't wait for winter. I am more of a cold person than a hot weather type of guy which is so weird because i was born in puerto rico and that's all hot weather i just i don't love hot weather i don't <laughs> anyways let's continue on with the story let's see what we got to do here damn devil's breath is gone i should call mj and warner this is Mary Jane Watson. Please leave a detailed message and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. What are you up to now, MJ? Standish said the demons are looking for something at GCT. But what could they possibly need here? Should probably call Peter and let him know what I'm doing. Actually, scratch that. He'd probably just tell me to go home and chain myself to my laptop. I'll just check things out quick and let him know what I find. From paper cuts to gunshot wounds, Oscorp's patented nanotechnology can increase the body's healing rate by 1,000 times. We're not just saving you money, we're saving lives. Okay. Interesting. Ooh, is this like a new tablet, new laptop they're making? Oscorp's research and development team are hard at work on a radical new form of battery that recharges itself from sound waves. In a few short months, you will be able to buy a phone that will never have to be plugged in. Dude, that hmm. honestly sounds amazing. Cool. A phone that you never have to plug in? Like, that's awesome. <laughs> that would be so freaking awesome. Ooh, what's here in the middle? Just a few years ago, optical My camouflage turn. was the stuff of science fiction films. <laughs> but with Oscorp's patented magnetic resonance arrays, cloaking fields are very Let much a reality. Picture. Not Try it for yourself anything. and see how Oscorp is making your world better each and every day. <laughs> Let me try. Incredible. Right, here goes. That is so cool. <laughs> how do I look? So That's cool. really, really cool. Okay, what are we supposed to do exactly? Ooh. Oscorp's revolutionary bioenhancer focus strengthens your body's whole nervous system, allowing you to stay awake and active for over 72 hours without any side effects. At Oscorp, we are giving you the greatest gift of all, time. 
Nice. I wonder if Oscorp is overpromising right now. Like, are they overpromising? What's over here? I don't know exactly where I'm supposed to go. Check out those Oscorp displays. Well, that's what you've been doing this entire time. But okay, let's check this one out. This Gaia microbe dispersal device releases specially formulated microbes into the atmosphere and in turn leaves our oceans and rivers cleaner than when man first walked the earth. Mr. Lee. This will be easier for everyone if you remain calm and do as I say. Police! Over here! No! Office. I would like to speak to Mayor Osborne. Who's calling? The man he is looking for. What do you want? I want you at Grand Central Terminal in 30 minutes. By yourself. Or there'll be more blood on your hands. I'm on my way. Are you hurt? No, I'm fine. Just hurry. Going as fast as I can. What are you doing at GCT? I'll explain later. Listen, Lee's going to release the Devil's Breath. You've got to get out of there. He's not going to do it until Norman Osborne gets here. Wait, this must have been Lee's plan all along. Make Norman responsible by forcing him to release the Devil's Breath himself. Sort of makes sense in a twisted, psychotic way. Okay, I'm here. Coming into the terminal now. Anything I should be on the lookout for? Looks like he's got some drones patrolling. Guess he's prepared for you. Don't worry, I'm in the ventilation system. Can you see a safe exit point? I have a family. Southwest corner. On my way. closer the drones will spot me see that tablet i'm looking at that controls the drones think you can snag it yes if you can distract them and not get shot i'm ready tell me when okay i'm ready incoming you <laughs> to Mayor Osborne. I can help make sure he arrives on time. How? First, let him go. Jump 
can't let him see me. Wait! Well, I didn't expect him to turn around so fucking fast. Jeez, that dude turned around hella fast. <laughs> Okay, so he's going that way. There's a drone. Should I be worried about the drone? I feel like I should probably be worried about the drone, right? I don't know exactly where I'm going. I'm guessing it's this way. Uh oh. Drones, get to cover. You still got that tablet? Yeah. Better work fast. Okay, I got this. Come on. Almost there. We did it. Good job. Now let's get you out of here. What about the devil's breath? I'll come back for it. No. We're partners, remember? Can we argue later? If we don't help those people, they could die. So could you. I can't let that happen. No. No, I got myself into this. I'm getting myself out. What do you mean you got yourself into this? Let's start taking him out. Quietly. They're still too close. That did it. Grab him. Take him out. Am I supposed to head downstairs? I think so. Break up that group. I'm gonna try and separate them. Take him. Now. Okay. So far, so good. He's alone. Right? Come on, dude. Yeah, man. Really? Do it. MJ, did you know Lee would be here? Not exactly. What do you mean? I thought something might happen, but not like this. Why didn't you tell me? I thought we were partners. Hey, partners trust each other, Peter. What do you mean? I trust you? Yeah, when I'm sitting at home behind a laptop. Oh, come on. Can we please get back to saving the city here? Is that guy alone? I can't tell if that guy's alone. Uh, I don't know if that's gonna work because I can't tell if he's alone or not. No, apparently he is not alone. Right? He is alone. Well, Peter, can you do something about him then? He seems like he's alone. Uh, oh, this is not good. Take him. Okay. Wait, who almost saw us? I don't know what that was, but okay. Um, shit, I have to separate these guys, right? Can I sneak on by without being seen? Okay, great. Uh, what if I make him go that way? Now. Is he? Take okay. Him out. I don't know where to go next. Shit, how do I separate these people? Why do I hear footsteps behind me? Gotta get past him. I'm ready. Do it. 
Start the timer. Keep him busy. I'll take care of the devil's breath. You know what you're doing? No. Oh, okay. Looks like the blue is connected to the battery, and yellow to a fan. Red one has a little exclamation mark. Okay, you'll want to detach the wires from the battery first. Trace the wires to the other end and unplug them from there. Okay, unplug the wires from the battery. I was so confident about that too. I was so confident about that too. Okay, what do you see? I see four wires. Two blue ones, one yellow. Oh, okay. Looks like the blue is connected to the battery. Okay, pull the first wire. Now the second one. What? The timer just changed to 30 seconds. Uh, it's a collapsing circuit. What comes next? The fan? Then the last wire, but you have to hurry. Okay, now the red one. Got it. You did it. Wow. Yeah. Now let's get these people out of here. I could use a little Spidey help. You ready? Right. I'll clear a path. Try to do it quietly. We'll do. Let's go up here and perch takedown. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Okay. Also, Insomniac did an amazing job with this building. This place looks beautiful. Uh, can we perch take down you? No, I don't think you're safe. No, you're not safe anymore. Well, now you are. Gotta be careful or the hostages will get hurt. Uh... It says web strike takedown? Shit. Uh, I, I kind of want to keep doing perch takedowns, but I don't think that's gonna... Okay. Come on, can one of you guys turn around? Why is Lee so hellbent on terrorizing New York? Uh... Okay. I don't have to worry about the drones anymore, right? Yeah, no, I don't. Okay. Uh, can we go over here? No, not here. This is not where I'm meant to go. I'm meant to go up. Oh, this is not where I'm meant to go either. Oh, no. Oh, no, no, no. Go up here. Go up here. Go up here. Jesus. I'm trying to, like, get to one of these flagpoles. There we go. That's what I meant to grab. Uh, now there's three guys up here. Um, ooh, there's flagpoles here. Okay. Never would have taken hostages like this. He was right. I'm starting to miss him. Sleep it off. Okay, so far so good. Um, shit. Uh, can we perch here real quick? Okay. So far, so good, I guess. Just need to take out a few more. Then it'll be safe for you to move. Hurry. How many more are there? I think it's just one, right? No, 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 it's not just one. Uh, it's this dude and this dude. Can I? Okay, let's go up here. Okay, MJ, time to go. Copy that. Everyone, follow me! Here, come in, 
Side of MJ. Wonder what side I'm on right now. Okay, guys, trivia time. Did you know Grand Central has the largest basement in New York City? Crazy, right? You could fit half the Brooklyn Bridge down there! Ha! Huh, I agree! You sure don't make them like they used to! His escape plan is to use the train. Can't let him get away. Train platform is open. That must be where Lee is. Getting away. Finally. Sorry I'm late. It's kind of my thing. I just...
don't want to hurt you! Nothing can hurt me! Not anymore! No brakes? No problem. <sighs> it totally worked last time. Yuri, they still doing construction on 42nd and 1st? Streets closed for another month. Why? <sighs> Next up, prison. Jane Watson, please leave a detailed message and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Uh, hey, it's me. Let me know when you want to talk. Texting isn't talking? No, 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 not that kind of over! Please say no. Huh. Okay, okay. And not okay. What is there to figure out? Oh, you think? The one that got away complete. Awesome. You did it. Lee's off to the raft. The devil's breath is safe with Sable. How do you feel? How do I feel? How much time do you have? Not much. Heroics for you means paperwork for me. But I just wanted to say, good job. Thanks, Yuri. I kind of needed that. Well... All this time with Lee, I've been ignoring the city. Time to get back to being a friendly neighborhood Spidey. Well, um, things surely got a little bit awkward with MJ. Yeah, yeah, things got a little bit awkward. That's okay, you know, things get awkward here and there. Um, yeah, that was a really cool, um, boss battle with Martin Lee. Even though I kept screwing up the quick time events in the train, I kept screwing that up. A lot <laughs> because sometimes I would think that he was gonna throw his power right down the middle so I would try to go to the side but he actually did the ground one so it would hurt me anyways it was it was a mess it was a mess but I really enjoyed that mission um, and I'm also going to leave this video off here because I'm hungry and I think it's time for me to eat dinner and because I feel like this video has been really freaking long <laughs> um, but yeah I'm gonna leave this video off here thank you guys so so much for watching please comment like and subscribe if you're not already a subscriber and I hope to see you guys in the next video. Bye, everybody.